Crosby, Stills and Nash and uh, <laughs> Marrakesh Express. The rustling that you could hear there was Anthony who has arrived in the studio. Good morning. Good morning and the reason for the rustling is I've got some chocolates to go with the coffee. <laughs> You, oh, you're a terrible You man. see, and I also withheld them purposely. You should see Pam's face whenever the chocolate comes out, or a couple of weeks ago, the champagne. <laughs> and I thought, I've got to catch this. But usually she, hoot, she didn't hoot this morning. Anyway, Pamela, you can open those. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Um, shall we say, oh, the chocolates are available. Uh, Lindor <laughs> orange ones. Oh, <laughs> I, I know, I know. Right, well, ooh, right. Oh, you, you, you sinful man, you sinful. I know. Uh, so we're, we're nearly up to the musical Who Am I? Now, it is a hard one this week. Um, I'm really going to test you this week. Well, you know jolly well that I'm not going to get it. Last <laughs> week was an absolute fluke. First time in my life. <laughs> Well, you never know. You never know. I'm going to give the uh, listeners a, a, a few clues, though, because it is a little bit more difficult this week. Let's it's get this a... chocolate started. <laughs> ooh, ooh, this time in the morning. I'll tell you what, I could eat chocolate any time of the day. <laughs> uh, so let's, um, let's get your thinking caps on. See what you can make of this week's musical Who Am I? Three musical clues to one well-known person. The other clue I'm going to give you is currently in the news. <coughs> there we are, that is this week's Who Am I feature three musical clues to one well-known person. Now he's not going to give you the solution until after the news but he did work it out didn't he? Nearly. I've got my hand over my mouth, it's amazing, you won't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> nearly, nearly needed a little bit of help, but the yeah, got, got there. So you, you, you heard uh, three tracks that will give you uh, one well-known person. One of them, the clue lies in the artist. The other one lies. In, the other two clues lie in the uh, title of the song. So um, yes, you all right? I'm really, really well. We've, we've got settled down. We're settled down. Are we so settled? I'd actually like to do the Pamela catwalk today because I've noticed something extraordinary about what you're wearing. Oh, go on then. So the first thing I noticed was Pam is not wearing her plimsolls. Oh, She's yeah. wearing these camel coloured, what would you call those Pam? Well, they're, the just, they're just very, very comfortable sort of moccasin clothes. Yeah, but the brownie it's... back with very distinct purple, you know, the, the, the colour of her own purple shoelaces. <laughs> And somehow she's managed to coordinate that with everything else. Oh, shoelaces. I'm, I'm just, I'm just a fashion icon. Mate. Well, no, I know. So, so the, um, I don't know how to describe that checkerboard top. So the checkerboard top has, has a range of colours in it. Mm. But the extraordinary thing is that and the cardi they match the Ooh. spectacles. So the spectacles, <laughs> the spectacles are purple in the centre. They go out through a green. They wrap around to orange at the back, and they've got polka dots everywhere. Ooh. And this polka dot matches the checkerboard. It goes all the way down and matches the shoelaces. Yeah, and so, you, you can actually, you can also read my shirt. Excuse me, I'm just going to lean over. Oh. Co you can. Okay, so zest, cobalt, cinnamon, sky. Walnut. So the colours. Oh, so are these are spices. This is very clever. This is subtly saying very spicy. <laughs> <laughs> and oh. of course, it all goes with the hair. Well, yes, which is getting to the point where it's going to need to be done again, Anthony. It's getting a, another fortnight and I'll have to have a bit more colour put through. It's a lot darker at the back. That's very, very clever. Well, that's, that's you just, wow, it's very dark from the back. Yeah. Oh, I I'm, I'm just, like I say, I'm just a fashion icon. <laughs> <laughs> if you see a if you see a lady with purple hair walking away from you, very dark at the back, just call out, "Hello, Pamela." <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, no, now then, I'm going to have to have a little shuffle around. I'll tell you what. I'm going to put take, put that one in. Take that one out because we've talked too long. And uh, my timings have gone all to pot, but it doesn't matter because I can do that. I'll see you on the other side. <laughs> good day, good day, good day. Still got a bit of an overrun. Eden FM. Hey, have you woken up yet? It's Palm's Breakfast Show here on Eden FM 107.5. 107.5.
And welcome back to the third and final hour of The Breakfast Show. And uh, over to Anthony for the solution to this week's musical, Who Am I? Woohoo! It's amazing, I almost got it, but not quite. So, the three hints were True Faith by New Order, the keyword being order, and the next one was Speak, Speak to Me Pretty, the keyword being Speak by Brenda Lee, and the next one was Love of the Common People, by Paul Young. That's right. So, order, speak, common. I straight away went to Parliament. And anyway, who goes, order, order, order? It's got to be John Burkow. It really, really does. <laughs> well done. <laughs> His little face again when he got it right was, was amazing. Well, I didn't quite get it right because I went to the Prime Minister because I was a bit, and you just knew that I wouldn't get it because uh, I don't get these things. Oh. So I just heard common and I thought common and I thought, okay, it's going to be the Prime Minister. And then Pam said no. And then, and then I said, okay, Jeremy Corbyn. And then she said no. And then order, order, order. So I had two extra hints. So you it, did. Yeah. You did. So if you got that uh, solution, well done. There will be another uh, one next week at the same time next <laughs> next Thursday um, and uh, tomorrow behave I'm having a chocolate do you know it comes in here um, n tomorrow uh, we will be having the random year generator giving me three years to uh, pre present three number one hits from those years that uh, were the number one in this country uh, for this particular week and our uh, yesterday once more feature. So uh, I'm being distracted by coffee, chocolates uh, and, and Anthony. Need I say any more? Let's uh, <laughs> oh, and just again, a uh, very good morning to Josh at Trade Copiers. I hope you have a great day and you enjoyed Morning Glory from Oasis from Sue. <laughs>